What's going on everyone, this is Dom, and today we're taking a look at the Huawei Mate 8. And this is a beast of a smartphone with some pretty boss specs, and if you want to see a full review, be sure to leave a thumbs up. Anyway, let's jump into the unboxing experience with this whole thing. Huawei always does a nice job with presentation and packaging, and they don't skimp in the specifications department either. The Mate 8 is packing a Kirin 950 octa-core processor, 3GB of RAM, or 4GB depending on the variant, and a 4000 mAh battery, which Huawei says will last Last you up to two days. Inside of the box you'll get the standard stuff you might expect but everything is put together nicely. There's a wall adapter and a standard micro USB cable and along with that we have a nice little pair of earbuds. Now inside of the last box you actually get a nice thin case to protect the Mate 8 and some paperwork. The phone itself is similar in style and features to the Mate S which I reviewed a little while back and link below if you want to check that out but there are some nice improvements here as well. First off around the front you'll find a massive 6 inch 1080p display covered by Gorilla Glass 4. There's also an 8 megapixel selfie camera but the camera on the back side is packed packing a 16 megapixel Sony sensor and seems to hold up pretty well in most conditions, but more on that in a future video. There's also a pro mode for stills and video which I can definitely appreciate and below the camera you'll find a fingerprint sensor which works on point with Huawei's Mate S and the Nexus 6P. As far as software goes you'll find Android 6.0 Marshmallow which is definitely awesome. It's been skinned by Huawei so it has a bit of a different appearance but for first impressions the software seems pretty smooth for the moment, but I'll save my judgment for the full review. There are also some enhancements that come along with the software like knuckle sense which will allow you to perform various actions by using your knuckles on the screen but there's really a lot to explore here and I just wanted to bring you a quick unboxing and overview of all of it let you know what it looks like how I feel and if you're interested in seeing a full review be sure to leave this video a thumbs up and also let me know what you think about the mate 8 in the comments section below. Thanks again for watching everyone this is Dom and I'll catch you in the next video.